fans, this is The Skull Clown here to talk about Kingdom Hearts and also my thoughts and my ideas about Kingdom Hearts 3. Um, I'll keep looking at my t-shirt because I keep thinking I have something but I don't. So anyways, let's get started and if you hear back, <laughs> if you hear background music, Spanish background music, I apologize. So, um, without further ado, here we go. You probably can hear it and someone sing it. But anyways, my ideas of Kingdom Hearts 3 and my thoughts. My thoughts for Kingdom Hearts 3. <laughs> I can't wait for it, actually. I cannot wait for the game to come out. I can't wait to see what characters are going to put in. I can't, I, I, I can't even wait for a fucking trailer for this game. Once a trailer comes out for this game, I'm going to fucking talk about it. I'm going to fucking review it. Just like I did with the, um, with the Cuss of Chucky review. Um, Cuss of Chucky trailer review. But I love what I see from Kid Mods 3. I think it's going to be great. Um, how many wards should be there in Kid Mods 3? I think there should be at least 25 wards. Because to me, they're going to gonna, they're gonna have wards that they're going to bring back. Even though people don't want them to come back. They have, but they all go, all going, they're probably all going to come back. Mainly because storyline story line prefaces. And then after Kid Mods, after the saga of Xehanort. They just gonna do more other wards before after they get rid of the old wards, and they also will add n new wards there too. Don't get me gone. Um, and what wards? This is now ideas. Uh, what wards I would like them f for them to see. By the way, this is not gonna have Star Wars in it. So if you guys are saying, "Thank God he's not saying Star Wars," that's so fucking cliche. Or if you guys are kind of disappointed in me talking about not talking about Star Wars, then sorry. Um, I'm a big Star Wars fan, don't get me wrong. It's just that I think they should just do Star Wars in another generation of Kingdom Hearts games. You know, let this generation be over and do another generation. I, I, I That's that's what I think. They might do the, th the same thing with Pixar. Um, I would love to have see Pixar movies in Kingdom Hearts 3, but I don't think we're going to get it. But if we do, that'd be awesome. But obviously, I will say... Um, some Pixar movies here too, um, except for obviously Star Wars and Marvel. Like I said, next generation. Uh, <laughs> so um, they probably won't even put Marvel in. It would be kind of cool, you know. Stitch is walking past, and then Venom comes out of nowhere through the walls and screams at Stitch, and Stitch just sticks a tongue out at Venom. That'd be great. And just classic, right there. Um, <laughs> just just showing that on the trailer, I'd just be like, I'm sold. Um, <laughs> but, um, so yeah, the words that I would like for it to be in Kingdom Hearts 3 are, and I, I might put some of them that's from Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2 and Chain of Memories and the rest of the Kingdom Hearts series, so, so I, mainly because of storyline preferences. So anyways, go. Um, Agoba. Now a lot of people might say, why Agoba? Um, they have to go. Why? Because the... The Seven Princesses. Jasmine is the Seven Princess, right? So they have to do that. Um, obviously, um, and there's another world that I want them to go to, go to um, Olympus Coliseum. Now, a lot of people might not like these two worlds. A lot of people don't want to go back to these two worlds. But I think that they should go back. Mainly because the Olympus Coliseum could do a lot more. With, they can do so much um, with the Olympus Coliseum for Kingdom Hearts 3. Plus, Zack has to come back. Um, to me, the only way they could, the only way they can bring back Zack if they go back to Olympus Coliseum. I don't know. I can't see any other way for to make him appear some in another world. I mean, it, it, could it happen? Yes, but I don't think it would. Um, who knows? Maybe, 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 maybe they will. Maybe Zack will go to Radiant Garden, which would probably be awesome. And Z Cloud and Aerith and all that. That'd be great. I think that would be pretty good. I think I think that's what they're gonna do, and probably not have um, Olympus Coliseum. But that's just my thoughts. I think they should have Olympus Coliseum I mean, because you can do so much with it. It doesn't have to be a part of the storyline. Like, you could just put it there for practice purposes. Make them um, feel. Basically, Phil is basically saying. Hey, so you can come here anytime you want, this and that. If you ever want to, you know, love a guy and this and that, you can come here. And that's that's one of the greatest things about the Olympus Coliseum. You can always love a guy. And that's why I always do. I always love a guy because it's, 
it's to me it's better. Um, it's faster and, and everything. So moving on from that, um, obviously there's another word, um, Wonderland, and I made a video about this. Um, I made a video about a Kingdom Hearts 3 video like this, but I fucked up. So this is the start. This is the remake version. But um, I this is the part that I didn't talk about. Um, Wonderland, and I wanted to talk about this. Obviously, the, all of the princesses of Hearts have to make an appearance, and that's why they have to. And to, they obviously they have to because they mention it so many times, and. They had to bring their words back, and obviously, so all the princesses of hearts that I'm basically referring to have to come back for obviously for the end of the saga of Xehanort's saga. I mean, and should just be should be there. They obviously they have to bring all the words back that we kind of love, and probably some people don't want to see again. But you know, what can you do? They're the seven princesses, and a lot of people don't like Alice in Wonderland as a. No one doesn't like Alice as a princess. I don't know. I mean, Alice is not really a princess. But, they, but in the game, they made her as a princess. Now, now a lot of people said, are they going to put the Tim Buttons Alice in Wonderland there? You know what? At this point, I don't see no choice. Um, I, I think they're going to have to because Alice is much younger. They're not going to have the younger Alice. They're going to have the mature Alice. So yeah, they all going to do the Tim. They probably all they going to do the Tim Burns Alice because Alice, Alice is a princess in Kingdom Hearts Three you know, um, in the Kingdom Hearts universe, and they have to go back to that world because aren't, aren't they trying to get? Are they trying to help the Seven Princesses? And the Seven Princesses have to be there, you know. I mean, it's they all, all to me they have to be there. It, it's more than just finding, you know, um. <laughs> it's more than just finding Terra, Ven, and Aqua. It's more. It's it, it's about these princesses also. So maybe they will make an appearance in their world also. And hopefully, I'd like to see Tim Burns, Alice, and Wonderland in there. But a lot of people don't like using using real movies for Disney and Kingdom Hearts. Actually, I don't mind it. I really don't mind it. The Tron one from Kingdom Hearts 2, loved it. And from Dream Drop Distance, absolutely loved it. And obviously the parents in Caribbean from Kingdom Hearts 2, love it. Just love it. You can do so much things, cartoons, next to real life people. Love it. I would never thought a million years, Goofy and Donna right next to Jack Sparrow. I would never thought that in a million years. Now, the thing is, most people might have a complaint about that. Mainly because... How come Sora, Goofy, and Arnold don't, like, change? Like, how come they don't change their personality? They change their costumes, but they don't change their appearance. Like, Goofy should look like a real dog. Donald should look like a real duck. Sora should look like a real boy. I'm a real boy! But, um, I, I don't know. I don't know that they don't put detail on them. It's just too much. They just make them as, as they are cartoons. And obviously there is a little bit of detail on them. They just they look a little bit darker. That's it. And 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 depends what world they are like. Like like I said, um, you know, um, the grid, and well, basically <coughs> the Pirates and Caribbean are so. So using real life Disney movies is not a big problem for me. I think it's great, and it, it's just um, and it says. Expands the universe of Kingdom Hearts in my mind. Um, another word that I would love to talk about is... Um, there, there's so many words I want to talk about, but I can't do them justice. The other one is um, Lilo and Stitch. Um, and that has been hint hinted in Kingdom Hearts Bought by Sleep and Kingdom Hearts 2. And we all go we're probably going to see Stitch. And I love Stitch as a summon, so there you go. The other one is um, Chicken Little. Now, a oh, little chicken, which is probably chicken little. Um, but I, I love a lot of people don't like that movie, but a lot of people love chicken little, they love that little guy. Um, and plus, they like the whole robot, they just don't like the story, they just like the characters and all that. Um, I, I think, I think chicken little, I, I would love to see chicken little back. I loved using him in um, Kingdom Hearts 2, so. I hope I'm saying his name right. <laughs> I don't know what's his name. I just call him Chicken Little. Mainly because that's what he is. He's a chicken. He's small. He's little. So, 
um, hopefully they put him in Kingdom Hearts 3 as, maybe a, a, as a ward, you know, that'd be nice, I, I would love to see that, and so it can be in a different ammo, Donald and Goofy don't have to change as anything, because they're all animals, so it can turn into something, or maybe not, so it can just look like a human, um, or maybe so it can look like a chicken, <laughs> so it looking like a chicken, okay, oh, uh, next, um, now I might, throw out some characters there, this and that, that I want to see, like I said, I mentioned Zack, obviously Zack should come back, um, obviously Master Aeokis should come back, obviously he probably, these characters will probably will come back, now this is one character that, I, I made a video about this in my other channel, and you guys don't know it, I'm going to say it right here, Oswald, the lucky rabbit, no one has not talked about this, nobody! Well, actually not nobody, but I mean, people that have talked about Kingdom Hearts 3 had never talked about Oswald being in Kingdom Hearts. But people have made fan, um, basically fan-made videos of, you know, Oswald being there next to Mickey and Sora, Don and Goofy and all that. Uh, because Disney owns Oswald now. Um, do I think Oswald could be a big role in Kingdom Hearts? Yes! I, of course! I think he can do so... There's so much you can do with Kingdom Hearts. Um, Ward, um, the universe, you know? And putting Oswald there will make it even more awesome because you have Oswald's Ward from Epic Mickey and probably they won't touch upon that, but I really doubt it because it's a Disney game and they want to, you know, give a wink to the fans probably. Um, but I think Oswald should be in Kingdom Hearts. If he's not in Kingdom Hearts 3, like I said in my other video, um, I'm not going to go crazy, I'm not gonna, you know, go through a riot just because Oswald's not in it. They're probably saving him for the next generation, I mean, the next, um, saga of Kingdom Hearts. And I hope they do put Oswald, because Oswald is Mickey's older brother. How can you not, how can you not put Oswald the Lucky Rabbit in Kingdom Hearts? And if you want to check how, you know, how much of the storyline would have been, you can check out my video on my other channel. Um, about, you know, Oswald, the Lucky Rabbit, and Kingdom Hearts 3. You can check that on my other channel. Um, TSK, Everjo, and Everlast's channel, so. Um, I, yeah, like I said, I think Oswald should be in Kingdom Hearts. No one has not talked about this in their videos. Only people made fan videos about it. Um, that basically, like, drawing pictures and everything. They never actually talked to a camera about it like this. So, like I said, I hope Oswald finds a home in Kingdom Hearts because I love that character and now when I think of Disney I don't think about Mickey Mouse anymore I think about Oswald the Lucky Rabbit and when I first saw Oswald I I loved him I love that character um don't don't get me wrong Mickey will always be there for me but Oswald is like he's always been there <laughs> not for me but like for he was always there before any of this before Disney became something huge so, I think Oswald deserves to be in Kingdom Hearts 3. He deserves to be in Kingdom Hearts 3. Will he have a big role in the Kingdom Hearts universe? He better be. He fucking better be. Why? Because he is Mickey Mouse's older brother. Anyways, I'm done ranting and talking about that. Um, anything else? Huh. How many... Oh, I got plenty of time. Um, so, anything else I would like to talk about um, for Kingdom Hearts 3? Um, hopefully, I, hopefully they use a mixture of the gameplay of Birth by Sleep and Dream Job Distance. Because I really like those two command systems. I, especially Birth by Sleep. You can make your own shit and become a really badass and get shits that you and get powers that you never actually seen before. Holy crap, the shit that I, I put on Terra, Aqua and Ven in Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep? Awesome. Like, I was comp I was like, I'm making my own little recipe here and then it, it became it became some something. It's awesome. So, I hope they bring that back. Um, and a lot of people might be like, well, how about... Oh, um, another word that I would like to um, bring up is the Pocus, the Pocus Harness word. The po po oh, I can't even pronounce that. The Pocus Harness word. There. They should bring that back. Um, HMK actually um, talked about it. 
like, b both Riku and Sora go there, and to me, that should be their first one, like HMK said. Um, so they both go there, then they, they talk to the tree, Riku goes to a different path, and Sora goes to a different path. So, I think that would be perfect. And the other question I was going to say before this, um, was, um, who should we play as for Kingdom Hearts 3? Obviously, Sora. But, since there's, you know, <coughs> seven, since there's Keyblade wielders, I would love to play as, obviously, um, uh, Sora, Riku, um, King Mickey, Aqua, Ven, Terra, and I think that's it, <laughs> right? Am I, and Kyrie, there, Kyrie. So it's Sora, Riku, Kyrie, Ven, Aqua, Terra, and King Mickey. I would love to play as those characters. Now, as characters that should be come back, now, like like they said, Sora has the power to bring people back that they were lost. So, the people that I think should come back for Kingdom Hearts 3 are Ven. I mean, obviously Ven. Um, I meant to say Roxas, um, Shion, and Namine. To me, those are the three characters that should really come back. Especially Shion. <laughs> I love that character. I love Shion so much. She had to fucking die because of Sora. Fuck Sora. <laughs> I'm sorry. I love Sora as a character, yes. But I would take Shion at the end of the day besides Sora. Fuck Sora. <laughs> I love Shion. I love her character. I love everything about her. I just want to grab her and hug her. I love that character, Shion. And if I don't play as her in Kingdom Hearts 3, I'll go my fucking pits. Um, <laughs> but, um, I want to play as, uh, obviously, Roxas too, maybe. Probably not. But I would still love to play as, you know, Sora, obviously, uh, Sora and Miku. But I would love to play as Kyrie, King Mickey, Aqua, Van, and Terra. But still, I love C Shion. She was a great character. I loved her ever since I first saw her. Literally in Kingdom Hearts um, 358 slash 2 days. Not 358 over 2 days, okay? I'm going to call it the way I see it. <laughs> so, what? Oh, I fucking hate that. Um, but, whatever. I I love the character Shion. She deserves to be mentioned so many times. She had to die. Because of Sora. You... Fucking bastards. Uh, I just love Shion. And when I saw her in Dream Drop Distance, I was like, Shion. <laughs> like, I just want to hug her. She's so emo. <laughs> She's so emo. And uh, I kind of love that, actually. Um, I'm a little bit dark when it comes to that shit. Um, but I just want to give her a big hug, basically. And Amine, Amine is fucking, obviously, she's Kyrie, so she's hot. So, um... But, I want, I miss Shion. I want Shion back. And, what what can I say? I love Shion. Has to come back. So, uh, how many more minutes I have left? Still pretty on time. Um, I always have to check the clock. It's I mean, I always have to check the time. It's not one of those things that just sits there. It's a completely different, it's a camera that just has two sides. You have to look on this side. I wish I could have the other... Anyways, it doesn't matter. Why am I talking about my camera? Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to be fucking epic. There's nothing... There's nothing to say. No one's not going to say Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to suck. Whoever say Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to suck, you are fucking stupid. Kingdom Hearts 3 is hype... Is one of the hype games ever. For crying out loud! <laughs> Kingdom Hearts 3, once it was announced... Xbox wanted to grab it, and Nintendo wanted to grab it. They have it now. There's rumors that, I mean, obviously, Xbox is going to get Kingdom Hearts 3. You fucking lucky bastards. You are lucky that you have Kingdom Hearts. But the thing that I'm confused is, are they going to release the other Kingdom Hearts games for that system? they probably do it in time. But, anyways, Nintendo is also lucky that they're getting Kingdom Hearts 3 uh, for the Wii U. And they are so lucky. <laughs> I, I have nothing against Nintendo. Like like I said, I love Nintendo. You know, I, ever since I was a little kid, Nintendo was the first system that I was introduced. Then it was um, Sony, and I stuck with Sony ever since. Um, but 
Nintendo is lucky and Xbox, I mean Microsoft is lucky to get these two, to get this franchise. And obviously, it will, and they may, they mainly did this to make more money. I have no problem with it. To make more money, you know, some people don't have a X, some people don't have an Xbox, some people don't have a PlayStation Three. I mean, four. Um, so, you know, putting on the Wii and the Xbox. So it doesn't bother me. It might bother some people. It might say, "Oh, it's gonna be delayed." All this, you guys. The reason if they're gonna keep delaying this, it doesn't mean it's gonna suck. Sometimes it does. Oh God, sometimes it does. But I have faith in Square Enix as a as a person. I have faith with this game, Kingdom Hearts Three, and Versus Thirteen. I can't wait for Versus. I mean Versus Fifth. Well, Fifteen. Final Fantasy Fifteen. I cannot wait for Final Fantasy XV. It looks awesome, and I guarantee you that game will come out before Kingdom Hearts 3, obviously. Um, so, I, I can't wait for Kingdom Hearts 3. Tell me what you guys think about this video. Do you think they should have... You think... What, what do you think... What are, your, what are your thoughts about Kingdom Hearts 3? And what is your ideas to put in Kingdom Hearts 3? So, I talked about it long enough. I cannot wait for Kingdom Hearts 3. Um, hopefully they put some of the stuff that I asked for, or oh, and there's a couple of things that, um, these are just some bonus words that I want to put out. Toy Story, Monsters, Inc., Up, Wally, -E, and, um, they should bring back the, um, the Hunchback of Notre Dame back, in my opinion. Um, and obviously they should, uh, I mentioned Lilo and Stitch, um, they should, obviously... Lion King, they have to bring that back. Um, I mean, they don't have to, but they could. Uh, what else is there? Um, um, obviously, Cinderella. Obviously, uh, like like I said, the, the Disney princesses that are supposed to be there, the words will be there too. So you can't have the Disney princesses without the words, right? So, um, <coughs> the princesses of hearts. That's why. Um, anything else? Uh. I want to think of more words. Um, what is that? Um, what is another word? I can't think of any more. Um, but I don't want to forget some classic Disney um, movies. Don't get me wrong. I'm trying to think of it. I can't. Um, Bugs Life, I would love to see. Um, Small Soldiers. Not playing Small Soldiers. It's, not even, it's, it's, a, it's a DreamWorks film. But anyways, this is the Skull Clown signing off. And hope you guys enjoy this video. 